Hey guys, how you doing? I'm Cuban Miss Prime, and we're gonna look, take a look at an app called Deezer, which is basically a streaming app like Spotify that somebody recommend recommended me on my YouTube channel to do. And you know what? Thanks because I like it. Um, so let's take a look at Deezer. And right off the bat, you can see that they're both um, iOS and Android are, comp are different a little bit in the UI. Um, on the uh, iOS one, the, you got the, the the tabs on the bottom, and on the Android one, they're on top. I prefer on the bottom. But the only bad thing being on the bottom is um, the, see the play button on the iOS one you, and, vers and versus the the Android one. The Android one, you could tell which app you listen to or what app you're listening to, the song and all that. In the iOS one, in order for you to see which artist you li you're listening to while you're browsing the, uh, the app, you got to press the play button and it pops up this window here. And it's very nice. But on the Android one, um, you can always tell who's playing uh, the song you're listening to while you're navigating the app. So that's one advantage the Android has versus the iOS. And then the iOS one, I like. I do like the tabs on the bottom. So let's take a look at the home button right here. Let's go home. You can see that they're both similar. Let's scroll down, browse. Everything looks similar on the iOS and Android. Um, it even has podcast support, which is really nice. I didn't know that. Let's take a look. Uh, let's take a look at podcast support. See how that looks. And uh, also on the Android and iOS, they both have um, Chromecast support, so that's nice. Let's take a look at it again. First aid kit. Let's see how that looks. Okay, so I do like the. I like both. They look nice. Um, let's take a look at one of the. One of the topics here says lead pace. Let's see. Let's see the button. What what options you get, and how they look. So there you go. You get the podcast. Um, podcast info. Okay, let's take a look at browse here. It browse by genre and moods. Let's see how that looks. So, so far, they both look very similar. New release. Okay, so that, they both look good. Bo um, I don't see that much different in both. Um, brand new North America. Let's take a look at that. Let's tap on the buns on top, see what it does. So the iOS one does have something different called add to my music. I don't see it on the on the Android one. Okay, so and then you got shuffle play. I don't know if the if this button here also means shuffle play. Let's take a look at money long the options. See what kind of options they give you. Add to queue, play next, add to my favorite tracks, add to playlist, share. But I do like the Android UI better, man. I don't like this iOS UI. I like the just the simplified uh, material design on the on the Android one better. Okay, now let's get out of here. See one thing I like about the iOS one, you could tap home right here. On the Android one, on the Android one, I gotta go back, 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 back. So if you tap home on the iOS, it takes you straight back. On the i, on the Android one, I have to do this back and back and keep hitting back. So that's one good thing about having a, a, the tabs right there already. Let's take a look at my music. Um, I don't see my picture on the iOS on the uh, on the Android one versus the iOS one. Now let's scroll down, downloads, favorite tracks, playlist. Let's see what happens when you tap downloads. See how that looks. Okay, that looks good. Let's see favorite tracks. Okay, and then see now it shows the pictures on the Android one. It shows my picture on the Android one, but not on the iOS one. It's just weird, man. How, how they, they they you know they design these apps so differently in in some way. Looks the same. Mixes looks the same and what is apps what is that apps okay just different apps from the company i think in podcast you got it right there podcast okay so um let's scroll to uh my uh flow see what flow is welcome to flow get started so it, it is really nice and one thing i like about this app is um, I do like the, the the microphone means the lyrics. It shows lyrics. I like that. Okay, and then we go back to uh, search. Let's search. Let's search for uh, Stabbing Westwood, one of my favorite album, uh, artists. Okay, here we go. Now, let's see um, how that looks. And then we're going to tap on here, see how that looks. Both look really good. 
in my opinion um lyrics what the hell lyric there's no lyrics on the ios one yeah there's lyrics on uh, options on the android one i could be it could be a little mistake you know what i mean you got the chromecast support here you got add to music here see how that looks okay i like that uh tap the like button and then let's see the options here add to queue play next add playlist remove from favorite tracks man i love the android ui so much nicer man okay and then you got lyrics here see lyrics it has lyrics here why is not showing on the android on the ios one so it's gonna play all this it's from stabbing westward what else audio equalizer equalizer off there you go activate so uh, all the options are scattered differently okay we're gonna take a look at the settings menu see how they both look you can see right there they both look similar my account audio settings app settings which is but so that's what it means app settings this usage cash you could change the cash which is nice you could just change it like this if I want to take um, you know take advantage of my uh, internal uh, cash I like that that is nice I don't know I don't know if Spotify has that option um, my accounts manage my account audio settings let's check a look at audio settings equalizer you got audio quality compact custom if you go to custom and you, you control the streaming over network download over network uh, streaming over Wi-Fi download over Wi-Fi which, which is very nice let's check it out see what options it has basic high quality this is a really nice app really nice app and then downloads via cellular network my connected devices offline mode these are labs press and hold for three seconds okay i see now so there you go guys um this is a great app man i really recommend this app if you if you don't like spotify or or apple music but i do like spotify a lot because of the dark ui and then you got notifications here little notification thing Keep track of the latest news. So there you go, guys. Um, that is um, Deezer. Um, if you like this app, if you like this video, guys, just hit hit the like button. But uh, let me know what other, what other apps you want me to to, uh, to compare. So there you go, guys. Thanks for watching, and you guys have a nice day. Bye bye.